Hi guys, Frankie here. Yes, it's been a while, I know. Like an idiot, I updated my Bedrock uh, client and I couldn't get on the server. But now I've managed to roll back and I'm here. And today we're doing a Q&A, as you can see by the banners behind me. Yep, questions and answers with me. Frankie. Nice to see you. I'm happy to be back. Quite excited actually. So, what are we going to do first? Well, we're going to try and get out of F5 mode. There we go. And we're going to have a bit of a wander around as I answer the few questions that I did actually get asked. We'll start over here. Because even though I put out on Twitter about questions, I didn't get that many many back. So this is going to be a bit of a short episode, but never mind. So the first question is from Mr. Crazy Crow, my brother from another mother. Uh, he's awesome, by the way. Um, go check him out. He's brilliant. Love him to bits. Um. <laughs> okay, that's enough. I get a big head if I keep shouting him out anymore. Um, right, his question: How do you feel about APB being the second best bedrock server on the network? Well, in two words, it's not. <laughs> in one word, no. In the other two words, it's better. Because I'm on here. Ha! No, I'm joking. Um, they're equal. Everybody's good. I love everybody to pieces. So, we're not second best. We're all first place. So, stick that in your pipe and smoke it, bro. <laughs> so, yes. Let's head over here to the uh, football stadium. Oh, I've still got a load of shock boxes out here. I forgot about those. What we got in here? Oh, that one's empty. That one's empty. We're doing good. Oh, that one's got stuff. Hello, stuff. That one's empty. That one's empty. Another empty. Another empty. Okay. Alright, second question is from Mr. JD. JDMC. Another awesome on the uh, APM server who I'm going to have the pleasure of playing with in season 2 along with Crow and a load of other gorgeous people and his question is how are you able to build an entire city and an amusement park well I don't work well I don't go out to work I work sort of at home, like housework, looking after stuff and things here. <laughs> so I've got a lot of time on my hands. <laughs> so yeah, and when it comes to building, once I get focused, that's it. I'm off. I'm up and running. I just want to get something completed. So yeah, just time, patience. And just the focus and drive to get on with it, really. So, I hope that answers your question, JD. These lovely football players I made. <laughs> yeah. It seems like ages ago I made all of these. Gosh, can't believe we're coming to the end of a season. So proud of this place. Be a shame to see it go, but I'm sure there'll be a world download. So fingers crossed for that. This is the latest mall of my uh, dome failure up there. 
think Code Girl started putting stuff in here. There's stuff. Clothing store stock. Well, the roof, the roof is done now. You can come back, Code. <laughs> right. Um, let's have a look at another question, shall we? So we've got TBG. Mr. That Bike Guy, who I believe is on right now. Yeah, he is. But he hasn't said anything to my hello, hey, whatever. So he must be AFK. Anyway, his question is how many diamonds have you accumulated over the season? And he also asks how I'm doing, which is very nice. Well, as to how I'm doing, I'm doing pretty good. I'm, I'm feeling the groove again. It's nice, it's nice to be back. Let's go and see how many diamonds I've got. Because, you know, I'm, I'm not really that sure, to be honest. I know I've spent a load more on different things. Well, there's your answer. That's how many diamonds I've got. What's that? That's got to be over over 800. I'm not doing my maths, but yeah, and I've got some diamond ore here, so that is the diamond question. So there you have it. Let's uh, get that down here. Um, let's go this way. My smelter in there. That's about all I made inside that building. And that building. And that building. My storage towers, skyscraper is the only one that's actually got filled in a lot and cinema everything else not much going on <laughs> but never mind let's go in the cinema while I find some more questions all right we have three from the lovely intrigue intrigue MC another awesome out on the network. So, his questions. The first one is What's the best way of getting all these building resources quickly? Well, first of all, a lot of mining, obviously, and also buying it from everybody else when they have it in stock is another thing I've been doing a lot of especially sort of like uh, selling what I was selling the uh, dyes and the banners you know, so, so I made made quite a few diamonds and stuff there so yeah so just a lot, a lot of collection yourself and buying it <laughs> Why am I going that way? I don't want to go that way. I'm going to go this way. As I said to the uh, question from JD, a lot of time on my hands. <laughs> I can do a lot in a day. So, why am I actually walking? I can fly. Whoa! Is my light for broken? No? No, just bedrock lag. Okay, we're going here then. Ah, amusement park. Seems so quiet after that crossover day. Sorry about that cut, guys, but my internet decided it was going to drop. So, yeah, that was fun. Anyway, where did I get to? Um, Right, intrigue, yes. The second question was, what is your favourite biome to build in? Um, I'd say mostly plains, but I do like, I don't know if you know, but there's like 
in the dark oak area there's like little patches of like plains area where you get like the dark oak sort of around it's like i don't know oh, i don't know what you call it it's just like a small plains area inside the dark oak area that's all i can think of right now but yeah i think that's like quite hidden sort of area it'd be nice to build maybe a little i don't know fantasy area or a cozy like cottage area or something that'd be cool so yeah i would say mostly plain especially when i'm building big stuff like this you need a, a big flat area so and it's less work than you know building on something with a lot of hills around i mean like to demolish a bit of a big hill sort of like mountainy area back there just to fit this in over here so yeah <laughs> that was fun that took a bit of time i ended up using a bit of dynamite <laughs> so i just needed a load of it gone so yeah um and the final question from intrigue is what are your favorite building tips and tricks well i could answer this extremely short which would be i don't have any or i could go with the long answer of uh, I, I wing it most of the time but i do get inspiration from things like in the real world on the internet other people i watch a lot of videos so yeah if I see something that somebody else has built and I think that's really cool and maybe I can incorporate a bit of it you know into what I'm planning on doing so uh, yeah I mean there's tons of awesome builders in the network APM, APB, APJ and uh, also there's a lot of other people that I watch like Hermitcraft Truly Bedrock, and also I'm part of a couple of other servers that aren't, aren't with the network, but they're totally awesome people as well. That's Craft Away and the World of Solitude. Craft Away is another Bedrock server, and World of Solitude is Java. So, yeah, it, it, a lot of people just inspire me so much really um i mean rem i remember when i first started playing minecraft it was on the xbox 360 and i was crap to be honest <laughs> i was i think the first time i actually played i went into creative and i built an obsidian box just because i thought obsidian was pretty <laughs> i wouldn't even dream of it nowadays obviously but yeah and i also built a castle as well back then on xbox which looking looking back at back at it in my mind's eye um not the best <laughs> but hey we'll start somewhere from small acorns grow big oaks or something along that line i can't remember the exact saying but it's something like that and my small acorn has grown into this big oak tree here you know theoretically and i'm, I'm proud of what i've done i've come a long way and i'm truly grateful to everyone you know likes what i do I'm, I'm a pretty humble builder i mean i play about saying oh yeah look at me i'm awesome but you know, that's that's joking i'm not like that at all I'm, I'm a pretty humble person and you know when somebody you know comes up to me and says oh you did a great job on this or that i'm like wow thank you so much you know i get quite emotional about it and uh yeah i'm I'm just 
just somebody that likes to, you know, make other people happy by, you know, creating stuff. And uh, now I'm getting quite emotional. <laughs> so I think I might have to leave it there before, you know, tears start occurring. And uh, there's enough water in this park. Sorry, just hide behind the lilac here. Um, yeah, there's enough water in this park. <laughs> With, oh, I can't see it. Where is it? Oh, it's back there somewhere. My log flew. So yeah, um, I think this might be the final episode of this season. But there might be something special coming up in the future. So stay tuned because there's also season two coming soon. But I'm pretty sure there's going to be something else between now and then. So don't run away. We'll be here doing stuff and things and all the things. Hello. Yes. Oh, so on that very mysterious note, I'll see you again soon. So take care, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.